today I'm going to show you how to do a silhouette entry. So I'm going to go onto Google Images and I'm just going to look up weapons silhouette. Um, so it's such a weird word to spell, but yeah, I'm just going to look up weapons silhouette. I changed my search to weapon silhouette without the S on the end because it was coming out with too many weapons at a time and I wanted a single one. So um, then when I scroll through, I found a gun and I'm like, that's a cool weapon. So I decided to choose that. So you could open Lightbox here and adjust the gun to um, fit underneath your page. But I'm just going to copy um, while looking at it because I'm pretty confident at doing that. So I'm just going to pencil out the shape of a gun. And once I penciled out the shape of the gun, I then pencil inside the gun the words that I want to write. In this case, I've written, Satan's weapons shall have no power. The most important thing to do when putting your letters into the silhouette shape, and it's the thing that makes the silhouette shapes, is to try and make as much of each letter touch the top of the shape and the bottom of the outline as, as much as possible. To do this I try and make my letters go together as close as possible and sometimes I even make lines um, so like a T might curve around the corner just so it's touching more of the surface as possible. So it looks like my camera skills are a little bit blurry again. Um, but this next part I'm writing no um, and the O is actually the trigger part of the gun. Um, so originally when I was trying to think of what I wanted to say, I saw that O and I realized that I needed a word with O in it. So I tried to reword what I wanted to say, putting no into the phrase. I quite like this even in just black and white, but I'm going to add some color. So the Bible verse I'm looking at is in Isaiah 54 verse 17 and it says, No weapon that is formed against thee shall prosper. Meaning Satan can throw weapons at you and he has all these weapons against you, but if you uh, have accepted Christ in your life and he's a part of your life, it doesn't matter what he shoots at you, whether it's a um, spiritual gun or dart or whatever, it can't prosper against you if you have Christ. So I've just gone through with my colourful pit artist pens and I've just put some diagonal lines in the background of everything. I'm colouring in the no navy and then I think I'm going to use coloured pencils to do the other words that stand out. The coloured pencils I'm going to use are called Greta, Greta Colour. Uh, brilliant and the watercolour pencils but I find any kind of watercolour pencils work even kids watercolour pencils so I just quickly added a little bit of water over top of that and then it's done so there's an easy silhouette keep an eye out for more cool tips and tricks on my channel and don't forget to like the video and subscribe today